Hello everybody, my name is Stally111 and today I've got a little bit of a preview gameplay for you. A little bit of a first impressions too. I know I said I wasn't going to be, too, be doing too many videos, but today, I, well recently I got sent over a copy of Eisenhorn Xenos. And it's it's coming out in May, so I thought, why not? It's, it's just got a quick preview build. Uh, of the game. I'm going to be playing through a little bit of the gameplay, giving my impressions as I go. If you guys enjoy it, well, drop it a like and see where we go from there. So, let's play. Uh, let's just keep it on normal. And put the gamma up a wee bit. Boom. So, I have. N I, I know that this is in the Warhammer 40k the universe. Is a mirror to the future. Uh, yeah. Um, it's so developed by. Pixel Sutton 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 and published by the Games Workshop. I'm I do not sure exactly what the developers are called, the but I know they've got Pixel with. in their name because I saw the Pixel the in the name at the start of the, the, the game when it loaded up. All we have loved, all we have failed. Alright, so this is us. We are in. We're moving Eisenhorn. So this is based on one of the first, uh, uh, Xenos, one of the first books, or something, something, I, I'm not a big Warhammer person, uh, as I mentioned in my Vermintide video. There is another face to the truth. My name is Gregor Eisenhorn, and these deeds were mine. Right, you gonna let me kill people now? Let's see this combat gameplay. Oh, here we go. Introduction sequence. Ooh. This preview build is only the first chapter or first two chapters, I think, at the moment, and then the rest of the game is getting released. Um, but I doubt I'm going to be doing all that today because, well, it, I've, I'm, it's pretty late. It's pretty goddamn late right now. But I just wanted to do a quick video on this and. Uh, Give you a little bit of content. Murdin Iclon. I came to Hubris in the dormant of 240.M41, as the Imperial Side Reel calendar has it. Dormant lasted 11 months of Hubris's 29 months there we go. a year. Based on Xenos by the only signs of life, um, Dan something Dan Elbert. Patrolling the precincts of the hibernation tombs. This is developed on the Unreal Engine. Yeah, I'm not sure if it's Unreal 4 or Unreal 3. And pray to the Emperor, Both look good engines, and I've got it at 720p, so I don't know if that's the reason it looks a little grainy, or it's just a filter that's over the game, because it doesn't, it's not like it's low pixel, well, 720p, it shouldn't be that grainy. Um, I think it's just an artistical oh. style, and... Stay back. Hmm, it's, I don't think it's Unreal 4. It doesn't look quite good enough for Unreal 4. I mean, I've seen Unreal 4 games, or tech demos, and they look spectacular. I should have probably looked at the genre of this game, but... Alright, there, boom. Be careful, Loris. You know how dangerous Iclone is. He's an animal, a dangerous one, but we'll put him down. We'll put him down. We have him cornered. Oh, That'll make him too, too much shine that? on those eyes. You two eyes Hers, I mean. Maybe the eyes are just too big. No, I'm just... He's alright, but I'm not sure I'm too keen on... Mm, he looks a bit waxy there. <laughs> I'm still not 100% sure. Excited, eager to close and conclude a business that had lasted six years. Iclone had evaded me for six whole years. I studied his methods every day and dreamed of him every night. Um, all right. Now, I could smell him. All right, you've got a, a sword under, under that, that coat of yours. I get to use it pretty soon. Because I'm pretty sure most of you guys here are to see some proper gameplay and me walking about some hallways 
isn't really what you want to see, especially in a gameplay video. That's just sort of a preview build and a, well, a preview in of the game. Rows and rows of ice and uh, to give a bit of a first impression and see if you maybe guys like want this game or not. I'm not sure. It's not even available for pre-order on Steam at the moment. But I never, I, I didn't hear about this game until um, they contacted me. Hello. You're the first bad guy of the game. Oh, hello. Can we fight you? Their eyes were dark and unforthcoming, as though they had done this mindlessly, by order. So I'm getting the vibe that there's gonna be a narrator through the whole bloody game, like someone's reading the story to you as you play the game. There we go. Boom. Nice. You loot 100 coins. Yes. Alright, let's get out of here. Let's get to uh, our friend, I'm assuming, who is in trouble after that radio broadcast that we just heard. Oh, just 75 coins. Three enemies! Oh no, what am I gonna do? Oh, attacking whilst yellow. Okay. Alright, so combat system is all about timing. Keep that combo up, and I fucked the combo a lot, a little bit up. I'm coming for you. I'm surprised we didn't make a massive leap of faith. Uh oh, but we're gonna pick up our gun and we're gonna shoot some fools. All my life, I have had a reputation for being cold, unfeeling. I am not, but I possess a singular force of will. To feel pain, fear, or grief is a luxury I cannot afford. Throughout my career, it has served me well to steel myself against all that this wretched galaxy can throw at me. Loris Vibben had served with me for five and a half years. In that period, she had saved my life twice. When I recruited her from the clan slums of Tornish, it was for her combat skills. But I came to value her for her sharp mind, soft wit, and clear head. I stared down at her body for a moment. I believe I may have uttered her name. I made a promise to myself. I would kill Iclom with this gun. Right. I'm not a hundred percent sure about All oh, right. Here we go. We'll eventually get the hang of it. Is us? Seems to be us. Camera controls are a little bit weird. I'm gonna quickly check in the settings if. Okay. Maybe lower it a bit. I think the FOV could be adjusted. Like, the settings is worrying me. When I opened the, up the settings, when I originally opened up the game, it worried me that it was gonna be like a, um, a port of a, another game from, uh, like, a, uh, a mobile device. Right, we're just moving on. We're gonna kill I clone. I'm pretty sure the guy, uh, the thing's name is. Um, I'm not sure who that is. Uh, as I've mentioned, I am not a fan of. Well, I've not looked into 
the Warhammer series. But we're gonna clear this next section and that I think should do it. Showing off the basics of the game. There isn't gonna be a, an awful lot more to show. Is I this the guy? Gregor, is that you? Okay, that's a little disappointing. Dead like they all are. Step out and make it quick. Show yourself first. Right. Let's try and kill Iclo. Oh. Where's the bugger? Convenient. Convenient. Oh god, oh god. Get, get the fuck down, you idiot. Conveniently, they're all below crouching level. Admit it, Gregor. You don't want to kill me. You want to join me. I've got to admit, iClone's voice acting is horrid. <laughs> like, the quality it seems inconsistent to uh, the rest of the voice actors and of course there is a cutscene to end it all I hesitated a merciful headshot would have spared her everything. But once awake, the hierarchy of hubris would not understand a mercy killing. Do you think me weak? Flawed? To set my duty before her suffering? I would gladly ignore one life in agony if I could save a hundred, a thousand more. For I have the moral strength required of an Inquisitor. Mankind must suffer so that mankind can survive. It's that simple. But to this day, I still dream of the slow death to which I abandoned her. Yeah. He, um... The screaming. Oh, the shit. Pounding. God, Emperor, help me. I will never forget that. Thousands of frantic souls waiting not where I want to go. I want to put this chest. And... We're flying! Sort of. Just fucking fantastic. It's a preview build. What do you expect? Right, so that's that, ladies and gentlemen. You've seen enough, I guess. You've seen me block, you've seen me talk to people, you've seen me slice up people and you've seen me shoot people. That's basically all you need to do in this preview and my first impressions is it's pretty solid to an extent. Um, Obviously it's still a preview build and it's coming out in another month and a bit and it could be tweaked a little bit but this is obviously a glaring bl 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 bug that they should get fixed straight on pronto um the dialogue of what's his name is it iclone cycle yeah iclone um it just sounds out of place and the the, uh, the field of view could be a lot further back for the the third person it just feels a bit too constricted but that's my thoughts. Um, make sure to drop a like, drop a comment, and subscribe if you've not done so already. And I'll see you guys on another video. If you've not um, subscribed, make sure to subscribe. Because that's something that you should do. And I don't know what I'm, where I'm going with this. Anyway, I'll see you guys on another video. And um, peace off.